Hello, this is Beaner4657, and we're back with more Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. It is now 1.08 a.m. Friday morning. Yeah, I didn't... I kind of didn't really feel like recording all day, but now that I need to, might as well. I mean, <laughs> why not? So let's uh, pick up some of these bomb bags, whatever. Yeah, I don't think it. Just so. Uh, oh, yeah, you can combine bombs with your arrows and make uh, bomb arrows. That was not smell. You combine stuff with your bow. Um, we it comes with 30 bombs, right? Okay, yeah. Yeah, Z, uh, Z for bow and arrow combination. And that's how you do it. But we don't really need that right now. So let's go for bombs onto the you pad selection. And let's uh, move on to the next area of Hyrule Field. Well, we've been in to that area in Hyrule Field once before, but only just for, you know, a brief fight. It was very brief, just... Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. It was very, very brief. Oh yeah, I forgot something. I believe we can use our bombs to get into an area in the back of the the village. Which is right there. See that wall? You see that wall? You see it? You see it? Well, that's where it is. So let's uh, take our bombs. There we go. And should be rubies or even a heart piece back here. There's a chicken. It's nice. I think we need it to fly. There's a black chicken and a white chicken. Interesting. You stupid chicken. Thank you. Chicken cuckoo, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, and notice when we bombed that wall, this er other area on the map revealed itself. So now we can... Um, crap. Forgot about this. You know what? Screw you, chicken. There's the treasure chest I was thinking about. These other bombs, we this that rock um, we can explode later with water bombs. Um, yeah, we'll get bombs that work in the water later in the game. Anyway, there's a piece of art, so we collected five pieces, and that refills another perk container. Okay, so let's finally get this next area of Hyrule Field underway. And I know I haven't really done many of the side stuff. And I know people who are pros at this game will be able to point it out. But that's only because I want to get all the, a the area of Twilight dispelled. <laughs> and I think I mentioned that before, but you really can't do much of the side stuff until you get Hyrule Castle uncovered. And you see, that, that, that does actually happen. At the very end of the game, only one place truly will still be covered in Twilight, and that's actually the Twilight one itself. Can go there. But enough foreshadowing, uh, let's get this over with. Or on with, whatever you want. I don't mean, I don't mean over like I want to get it done fast. I really, really love this game. So anyway, here's some of Hyrule Field that we didn't really get to see. Oh god, no! Why? Why? Why must you pester me? It's from Barnes. If you didn't see the dialogue enough, he said he was going to send a letter of how to actually put me to do that. Go back, go back, go back. Go letters. Bomb arrows. Okay, he just tells you how to put bomb uh, bombs combining with your arrows. Who cares? Okay, let's stop here for a second. Because there's a rock here and I want to explode this. I think, I think you can shoot it with an arrow and make it explode faster. But that wastes an arrow. So let's uh, go explore up here. Come on, Link. Don't walk. Run. Roll, whatever. While we're in Hyrofield, we might need to keep a lookout for golden bugs. You need, you need to collect these to uh, get the bigger wallets. But also, it's also a great way to get a lot of money really fast. So if you're ever short on rupees, you pick up some golden bugs. Because, well, you're gonna need those. Oh my god. I don't remember doing this. Okay, this is where we need to combine our bow and bombs. Oh, 
Oh! Whoa! Link's a daredevil. No evil can evil stunts today. If you if you didn't notice, uh, combining using bomb arrows uses up both one bomb and one arrow. If it wasn't obvious enough. Um, oh, I see it. Let's jump down these cliffs here. Wahoo! I hope it's a piece of heart. Or at least some rupees. Okay, yeah. That's kind of what I expected. Um, bu 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 okay, so we can't do anything else up here, so let's try and jump without falling down the end of this pit. Okay. Well, I don't, I'm gonna put those on there so I don't wanna. so I don't accidentally waste a bomb and an arrow, because that would suck. You don't wanna waste those. Besides, I'm low on arrows. I need to find a refill soon. Maybe I'll destroy some Boko Balls somewhere. This bird. These birds are so annoying. Were those weavers? Let's do the spin attack when he gets too close. Ah, just a rupee. Oh, yellow rupee. Okay, I guess that's somewhat worth it. Hey, every little bit counts. Alright, to the straight west, yeah, Twilight Wall. Um, regard disregarding that, uh, straight west, you notice this little thing right here coming, up, coming out of the map. Well, that's um, the Great Bridge of Elven. We can't really use it yet. Twilight Wall's blocking us. Oh, look, it's getting dark. Yeah, this is gonna be our first time seeing Hyrule Field at night time. Oh, wait, no, is that the Great Bridge of Elven? No, wait, that's the bridge that we fought the. where we had to joust the big. I think those guys are moblins. I'm not entirely sure, but that's really what I think. They're moblins. The guy in armor that we gotta fight. More lever, that's just what we need. After the sun sets, the, the, the music that plays in Hyrule Field will change, and it's actually kind of creepy in a way. Because you have this voiceover. Some weird. I don't know, but just let me tell you, it's, kind of, it's actually kind of creepy. So, here we go. There's a wall that we need a bomb. Yeah, the music just changed if you didn't hear that. It's raining, too. Wait, what? Oh my god, more shallow guys. Wait, but I don't have my- oh! Oh wait, that is the Great Bench of Elden. Oh great, the twilight portal sucked it up, and now we can't get past. Yeah, you hear that? You hear that weird voice? Oh great. Here, we'll keep, we'll, we'll have our horse, we'll, we'll let our horse carry us to the bridge and then we'll drop her off. Here they come. I guess we just spam spin attack. There we go. It's a little bit harder as a human, but if you just spam spin attack, then you can get it. Now this bridge is right above there's right above the bridge of Elden, so if you warp here with that huge gap, you'll actually fall all the way down there. Actually, I don't remember that happening. I think Minna just stops you from doing it. I think she'll say, don't you remember the bridge is that stupid? Oh wait, we can't get up there yet. We need a special item that we get later. We'll actually come into this area much later in the game. There's I don't know, something weird about that place. Oh! Well, here it is. This is the third and final Twilight Realm that we'll be going into. Or Twilight Zone. Ah, we're finally here. There's only one few shadow left. Damn it! I let it go into. stupid. 
So this is the last of the Twilight you'll see. Whether or not you'll accomplish your final test is fine all of you. Yeah, they say it's the final test, the final test that you'll get, but you know the game's not over yet, right? Just because you dispel all the Twilight, that won't stop Zant. Let me let you in the Twilight? Yeah. Be prepared, this is actually going to be the longest time we're going to be in the Twilight. This is the biggest. And I'm not kidding, this is really the biggest Twilight Zone that you'll see. Yeah. Actually, hang on a second. Oh, I'll bear back. <laughs>